director Brian Clare out. You guys are ready. Coach Clare out. Uh, just obviously the, the form the team in is probably less than ideal. Just what's the message to the squad at this point of the, the year? Well, we got to get back on track. It's it's not a team that uh, has not, you know, f four weeks ago, five weeks ago, we were one of the best teams in the league, right? So you don't just lose that overnight. Now, I reflect, I, I think about things. I think our last two games have been, uh, have been bad. Previous to that, I think we've done enough to win games. Um, we need to get the confidence back. We need to get our defense more organized, more aggressive. Uh, right now, we're conceding a lot of goals in the last three games. I think it's, what are we at? How many? Twelve in the last three games. It's unacceptable. And uh, it's my responsibility to kind of get this, to become a team that's hard to beat. That's what we talked about. And that's what we talked about after the first three games. So that's the message of the squad. We need to get that, that base uh, solidified. Scoring, scoring wise, uh, I guess just what, what, can you pinpoint an area where you guys are having some trouble in that in that aspect of the game? Where, where to start? I mean, if we if we look at our last two games, I don't think we've done anything good, right? Um, I think maybe RGV we had some t two two uh, goals. The second goal was good, um, but our overall play is is subpar. I think our passing is subpar. I think our uh, a ability to keep the ball is subpar, and I think our ability to defend is subpar. So um, we haven't been doing too many good things as of, as of late right now. Brian, obviously, I guess in moments like this when kind of just people start to realize the soccer's kind of, the, yes, the numbers are, they speak for themselves, they're black and white, but it's a highly philosophical situation of being sometimes you win, don't necessarily deserve it. Sometimes when you lose, you, you have put in good yep. performances. Um, what can you say to, to the fan base regarding that and just kind of reminding them of that? Now, listen, like we're, we're, in, we're in a position for the playoffs. And I, I said from game one, okay, our goal here is to, we need to get into the playoffs right away. Now, did I expect to go into this big of a, of a dip of not getting a win for this long? No. Um, but we will get through this. We will uh, turn this around, and we have no other choice. I said to the squad, adapt or die right now. So we're, we've looked at a, a few different aspects. There's, there's things that I need to change, that I need to, to do to make us perform better, and uh, we will see that this weekend. Uh, again, you segue perfectly into what my next question was. Obviously, with, with you know, kind of coming down and, and tumbling down on the position of the of the conference standings all, all of a sudden are you a little bit more aware of what those around you are doing as far as game in and game out listen we know we know where we sit on the table I, I i know where we are at the results and it's a tight table right now so again uh we're, we're in a good position based on our based on our previous results and now we're in a position where we can continue that. Now, we, we're in a position that we can't have uh, the same type of performances that we've had lately, especially these last two games, or else we won't. We will not be in this, this position that we are in right now. So our past work has provided us a, a little bit of legroom, but if you don't continue to get those results and to, and to get those points, uh, that legroom gets smaller and smaller. So um, that's where we're at right now. You're not at a point yet in the season where you've done uh, numerical analysis where, like, for example, there's 36 points up for grabs. We need an X amount of points to feel comfortable. It hasn't gone to that dire of a situation yet, has it? No, we have 12 games left, I believe. Um, like I said, it's focusing on winning, focusing on, on looking at our performance and, and being a better team, right? And the number one thing to focus on is, is to get this defense back in order. Last one for me, Brian. Uh, you go in your first time going to play Phoenix. Uh, weather conditions are always tough. A hostile environment towards the players and even the, the fans there know that a lot of people travel. So it's it's an intense atmosphere. Atmosphere. Just your thoughts about Saturday? No, I think it's a it's a team that's traditionally in this league has been a, a powerhouse, uh, probably the marquee name in the league. So I think it's a it's a good environment to be in. Um, we need to embrace it. 
let's play with that type of uh, pressure on us. Let's see what our group's about when we go through this adversity. Um, and let's prepare ourselves accordingly to be able to handle that and to get a win on the weekend. Thanks, guys.